So hi everyone, in this video, we look at what all checklist points a job ready programmer should, should have. We look at each point step by step and I'll tell you how you can be good at those steps. Okay. So let's start with the first point. The first point is you should have a good knowledge of C++, Java, or any other programming language that is object oriented programming language and then start solving DS algo problems. Okay. So you should start solving DS algo problems, at least two to 300 problems. Most of many people ask what is the count that we should have for DS algo problem. So there is no such count. If you are solving two to 300 problems, covering all the concepts, covering all topics. Okay. Then it is sufficient. That is the first step. Okay. So this will help you to increase your problem solving skills. So basically they, this is the only key point that is checked in the com product based companies interview. Okay. So this is the key part. So you should try to solve these many problems. It might be lesser than, but it might be greater than, but you should try to cover all the topics and uh, le let's get and should get very good at the conceptual part. So if your concepts are strong, then obviously you will be able to solve that problem. Okay. Let's move to the next step. The next step is having projects. Very, very important. So it can be of machine learning, it can be of web, it can be of Android, any topic. Okay. So any topic will go. This is the thing. So actually when you will join a company, a good company, then you will be working on some tech stack. Okay. It might be any depending upon your role. So if you are having a previous knowledge about the basics of web or machine learning algorithms or some things about Android Studio or any other tool related to them, then it's a very added advantage and it will also help you to make your resume good. Okay. So this is one another point. Resume part will become very good. Okay. So this is the second point. The third point is you should have the basic knowledge of these subjects because uh, in companies, when you are working on large scale projects, no, you will always face database things. You will always get you means you have to work around the databases. You need to know what operating systems help us and what all things they do. You need to have a fair idea about the server client architecture kind of thing, what all things are covered in networking. So having knowledge of them is very crucial and also theoretical plus numerical problems from these topics are asked in your technical interview. So that is why this is also one very important step. Okay. So moving to the next step. So the next step is working on your aptitude part. So it is generally asked in the OA part of lots of product based companies and also the maths probability thing. It's also sometimes used in the coding part. Okay. So you should have a good grip on this also. Okay. In order to get into good companies. Okay. So this part is also uh, very important. Some people just ignore it, but it is of really high importance. Okay. So you should be good at aptitude as well. Also one key point is knowledge of Git and GitHub. So whenever you will join a company. Okay. So this, these two things will be used each day in a software programmer journey. Okay. So this is very important. You had need to know about what is version control and what all things and terminologies are with it. Okay. So you, you should get well versed with these things. That is also very crucial. Okay. Because it will help you in your actual job. Cool. So next step is internship experience. So it is also one very important thing 
having good internship experience it will help you to understand how software engineers work means you will be getting exposure to some big complex projects which, which are very large scale okay so having internship experience is a cherry on top of cake it's like you will learn a lot okay so always try to apply for different internships so these were the different key points that you should get through with uh, and it will help you to become a job ready programmer so i hope you have liked this video okay so please like share and subscribe thank you